Welcome back, No Time to Explain Game. King Zeph here with another video. Happy Wednesday, everybody. Um, I know I'm a little late to the party, but with it being Wednesday, today is a live stream day. So to those that don't already uh, follow us on the live stream, 8 p.m. Central. It used to be 7.30, now it's 8 p.m. Central time. Um, we will be on the live stream. I believe we're going to be playing Dead by Daylight again this time. Uh, myself, Mrs. Ivy Friction, Ivy Friction, and I believe Ego the Humble Bragger, he all should be, all of us should be here. If not at the absolute, uh, at least myself and um, Ivy Friction, Mrs. Ivy Friction will all be on. So come by, um, say hi, hop in the chat, see us be a little bit hilarious and get terrified by these killers. But I digress. Today, um, I'm actually going to go through the Resident Evil 4 demo that was released like two weeks ago, if my mind turned me correctly. I know I'm late to the party. I'm sorry. It's been, a little bit, it's been a little hectic. It's been a little crazy. Um, things have been going on. So, yes, I'm late to the party. But the game does come out this Friday. Um, and we will be live streaming that as well um, when that comes out. So, this Friday as well, we'll be live streaming that. Me and Ivy Friction will be going ahead and taking care of that. So, for right now, we're going to go ahead and hop right into this demo. I haven't played it before. I have only seen light footage of the game. Um, well, basically whatever they've been showing in the trailers and any of the launch stuff and advertisements. So I haven't seen anything, haven't played the game at all other than the original years and years and years ago. So um, this will be interesting and we'll see how that goes. We'll see how awful I play the game. We'll see if I get murdered by a chainsaw guy or anybody else, but we'll see how that goes. So anyway, if you want some more content like this, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, Hit that bell so that way you know when we're on live stream or whenever new videos coming on. Have a couple more packed videos coming as well. So there's a lot of stuff kind of coming in the pipeline over the next little while. So for the time being, let's go ahead and hop over to the game. All right, Resident Evil 4 Chainsaw Demo. See, already they're trying to make this look spooky. Let's see where this goes. I already got the battery notification. September 30th, 1998. It's a day I'll never forget. The cop inside me died that day. And that night, Raccoon City was wiped out, thanks to the bioweapons created by Umbrella. Somehow I made it out, but too many others weren't so lucky. I was asked later to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice. The training, punishing missions, nearly killed me. But at least I kept my mind off everything. If I could just forget what happened that night. The pain, even for a second. This time, it can be different. It has to. Wow, they kind of went into like the whole, his whole little emotional roller coaster dealing with uh, Raccoon City. Like that addition. All right. It's been six years since Leon Kennedy survived the Raccoon City incident. An unprecedented biological account of uh, having his fingers from some U.S. special agent. He has tasked locating the president's missing daughter. He's in the valley in Europe. Even Leon's past trauma could not prepare him for the nightmare. Which says, okay. Oh, okay. They just jumped me right in here. Okay, cool. Let me turn this down a little bit. Echo myself. See what's taking so long. Okay, right off the bat. This is insane. I'm going to pick resolution. What's crazy is I kind of remember parts of this game, or at least I know how to like it opens. I don't remember anything about this at all like, in terms of like story or well, not really story. I would say so much of how everything progresses. But also since they how far like, could you have gone? They rebuilt this game. This kind of makes it easier to forget or maybe visualize what it's supposed to do or it's supposed to go. Uh. 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 
That's a like it ate a block of something. Oh, oh weird. <sighs> this is crazy. I should have replayed four. <laughs> I'm just like, I have four. I'm like, I should replay four. But I'm just like, you know what? I want to be surprised. So, I know there's parts of this game I'm going to hate, especially when we get to the maze boss, which is much later in the game. But I don't know. This is. This looks so spooky. Let's go. Anyone home? Yeah, I can't wait till there's actually light. Because he gets dropped off, so it's just like, how did you end up in here? This is giving me Resident Evil 7 and 8 vibes right now. True charm, judgment is nigh. Fine, okay. Hmm. This looks like it came right out of Resident Evil 7. Actually, a little bit at 8 as well. Can't read that. Things in Spanish. Okay, this is just a random dark corner. Oh, bro. That. Uh, sorry to barge in like this. Let's go home, police. You know a key? Why wow, speaking Spanish? I don't remember any of that. Must be one of the additions they made. Darkness, let's see. Okay, yeah, they changed. they changed quite a bit of this. But at least Leon, bro, Leon is smart. At least he puts the, the, the flashlight in his other hand. They could have did me dirty and said, oh yeah, you can only see the flashlight. This is reeks of Resident Evil 7. Like, in terms of graphically speaking, you know, like just some of the details and some of the stuff. Like I'm playing eight again.
Do me like that. It's like I'm down here, and then you just like, oh, escape. What was that? Two bullets left. What what do y'all want me to do? Dude, what did they do to this game? Hit me with the, oh, escape the huntsman allows. Pure Resident Evil fashion. Hey, we're gonna make this difficult. I have two bullets. First and foremost, I only have one clip of your sir. Hunnigan here. What's your sit rep? The president's daughter, Baby Eagle. Hmm. It's likely she's in this village. Sure, like old girl. Our intel was correct then. Well done. I know it's Capcom still, but you need a location on a nearby lake. She may have been taken there. Copy that. I'll see what I can find. Hurry up. Something's happened to the people here. My escorts are. <laughs> Let myself out. Yeah. Is it now? He's like, we are. Right. Okay. Yeah. Something's gonna give me some more bullets, cause uh, they expect me to do anything with two bullets. Yeah, for a rude awakening, but I'm just gonna die. Looking at this now makes me think Capcom might actually do Resident Evil 5. I don't kind of want them to, because I think Resident Evil 5 is fine the way it is. But the way they've been doing these Resident Evil remakes, well, they technically haven't done Resident Evil 1. That would actually, honestly, that would probably be, in my opinion, probably a better decision. Let's do Resident Evil 1 instead. But they, never, they did 2, 3, and now 4. They never did 1. Save station. 
that I can't use. Why do I even put it there if I can't use it? Okay, now parts of this look familiar. Did they, is the wolf dead dead or did they, I hope he's not dead. But in the original, there was a, there was a wolf that was stuck that if you saved, he backs you up in the Eligante fight. He, he, would, he would, um, pop in and pop out and help you. I hope that's not the same dog. Or they could be dirty and say, hey, that is the dog for the sake of the demo and they killed him. But in the real game, they died. Dirty, they killed that dog. That's a dog. Kill the dog. Maybe it's because of the fact that they allow you to actually like stick and move, which is a good thing. That's not bad, but you know when you're not used to that in the Resident Evil game, then it makes that a little complicated. Okay, I need to damn it. Caution of bear traps. Certify way to make sure somebody's dead in this game is that they, if they drop an item. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they did give you a first aid kit. Okay, they, they were nice. They were nice. This time.
They actually added a stealth element to a resident there. This is bananas. just you know forego a lot of the well let me get that herb and then kill what's her name and then uh run the house because really that's all you Shit. you can stay outside and, and, and fight them off but realistically speaking you need to run into the house to uh, because i think what happened last time in the original game you could stay outside and fight them off but after a certain point in time, it forced you in the house for the chainsaw guy to show up. So just to mitigate that, you could pretty much just say, screw that, just run up. Um, you know, run up, go ahead and uh, run in the house to trigger the chainsaw guy to show up. Because if my mind's turned me correctly, you don't have to kill the chain. Well, I don't know if they change it for the sake of the remake. They might have. But um, in the original game, you didn't have to kill the chainsaw guy. You just had to survive, I think, for like two minutes or something like that. And then, um, after we did that, uh, the church went off and then everybody left. I might have made a horrible mistake jumping into this house. I just need to keep it. Oh, he is stuck! Oh, I need to heal. <laughs> uh, he was like, I need to heal. <laughs> Bookshelves too, but there used to be two bookshelves. Bookshelves you put in front of it, and one. 
under a The game changed it. Uh, can I fix my knife? Nope. Okay. Okay, whew. I don't know how long that was. I think it was like three minutes or whatever it was. I did kill the chainsaw guy. Burned to death. trying to murder me he just wanted me to just be okay with y'all walking past me like oh okay you know time to go time to go pray that's a horrible detail on the door
Where's everyone going? Bingo? I'll take it. So I'm trying to do it. This is the opening part of the game. So is that the rest? Is that the demo? Yep, looks like it's it. Acquire 10,000, enemies kill 24, completion time 20 minutes. Give me a great rating. I don't know if there's a higher rating than great. Thank you for playing. And of course, the game is available on 324. If you want to purchase it right now, of course, if I buy it digitally, it will be Thursday night. Getting a physical copy. I have a physical copy in the video, so I might as well keep a physical copy of this. But, yeah, that's the demo. Okay, well, <sighs> that was mildly stressful. It wasn't really that bad, but it was mildly stressful. I'll give it that. Um, this game was crazy. It looks amazing. It, it's, I'm really getting the vibe from Resident Evil 7 and 8, at least graphically speaking, but because those are much newer games. So I, I, I get that vibe from this. But they made this game a little bit more eerie. Um, but also, we're looking at when did this game come out originally in 2003-ish? It came out on the GameCube. So GameCube era. So, yeah, like between, it was in the early 2000s. It was like between 2003. Yeah, I think it was 2003. I have to double check that. Regardless of whenever it came out. Um, seeing the game evolve to this point, of course, graphically speaking, it's you know over 20 years at this point in time. Um, it's gonna be crazy. So, um, that is the Resident Evil 4 Chainsaw demo. Um, that was a good time. The actual game drops this Friday, so we will be live streaming that. Um, once basically I come and pick my copy up from uh, GameStop, you know, get off work, go home, pick up my copy of GameStop, run the installation. So, I believe that'll be around the same period of time. Um, hopefully around 8 o'clock central as well, same time as a regular stream. Don't forget for the live stream later today where we're uh, going to be playing Dead by Daylight. So please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, tell me what you thought of the demo. Tell me if you played the demo or have you even played the original Resident Evil 4? Because apparently a lot of people have not played the original Resident Evil 4, which is... I mean, if you're not into horror games or in the Resident Evil genre, I get it. But it's still kind of weird that you've never... Um, I mean, if you're younger, then you wouldn't play it either way. But I digress. Uh, let us know your thoughts. Let us know your comments. If you um, enjoy this content, just let us know. Um, and yeah, so I will see some of you guys later tonight. Um, be on the lookout for other videos coming as well as see when this game launches on Friday for the live stream of that. So King Zeph here signing out. Peace out, guys. See you later.